Christ that strengthens us. Why? Because greater is he that's within us than he that's in the world. And if God starts working the power that he has placed in us, ain't no telling what's going to happen because he's able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we can ask or think according to the power that works in us. Tell your neighbor, yes, we can. Last one, the Joshua generation was a generation, understand, that actually possessed the promises. Oh, Lord, have mercy. You see, Moses received spoken promise, uh, but never possessed the promise. Moses received the promise, but Joshua acted on the promise. <laughs> Lord, have mercy. Joshua moved from promise to possession. Shake your neighbor and say, it's time to move. It's time to move. Uh, there comes a time when you have to get tired of just reading and hearing about the promises. There comes a time when you have to get aggressive in your faith, determination, and focus to possess the promise. Promised money can never be invested. But possessed money can be spent all day long. Uh, 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 the Joshua generation experienced the land of milk and honey. Moses heard, Moses heard about the large clusters of grapes. Moses heard about the pomegranates. Moses heard about the figs. But Joshua and the new generations ate them. <laughs> Oh, Lord, have mercy. The Joshua generation eats the good of the land. So I just stopped by to tell all of you assembled here today that it's time for us to open our mouth and decree and declare that we are the Joshua generation. Tell your neighbor, we are the Joshua generation. The Joshua generation go ahead and do what others fantasize and dream about. Trusting the Lord every step of the way and yielding to what he has for us. For he said in his word, I know the thoughts I think toward you. Saith the Lord thoughts of peace and not of evil to give you an expected end. Tell your neighbor we have to be. Come on, talk to your neighbor. Say we have to be. Those who expect something, we expect to be wealthy. Uh, yes, sir, we expect to be on the top. We expect to have doors open for us. Y'all hear me tuning up? I'm getting ready to go home. We expect to have ways made for us. We expect for our ministry to expand. We expect for our gift to make room for us. We expect for God to have favor on us. We expect lives to be changed when we say a word. We expect to lay hands on the sick and they shall recover. We expect to lay hands on the blind and we expect them to see. We expect to lay hands on the deaf and dumb. We expect them to hear and talk. Shake your neighbor and say, neighbor, we are the Joshua generation and we're getting ready to take over the world. We won't settle. I said we won't settle. We won't settle. We won't settle for teen pregnancy. We won't settle for drug and alcohol abuse. We won't settle for suicide. We won't settle to be a deadbeat father. We won't settle to be a runaway mama. We won't settle for fornication. We won't settle for homosexuality. We won't settle for a lack of knowledge. We won't settle for an STD. We won't settle for crumbs. And if we don't settle, eyes have not seen and ears have not heard. No, 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 no. It has not entered the hearts of man. The good things that God has prepared for them that love them. Yeah, yeah. Shake your neighbor and say this is the generation. This is our time. This is our time to show what God has.
has placed in us. This is our time to be the people that God is beckoning us to become. This is our time. Tell somebody this is. Come on and preach with me. Say, neighbor, this is our time. This is the generation that don't care how much money Oprah got. We don't care what Oprah got to say. We believe, and it's only true. There's only one way in, and his hair is like lamb's wool. His feet like polished brass. His eyes like flames of fire, and his name is Jesus. Yeah, yeah. This is the generation that won't cheat and trick our young people by using hip hop to bring them to Christ. But no, no, we will stand up and let the church be the church and be not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind that you may dokimanso, that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. This is the generation that will not walk around like gifted failures, but we will release the potential that's in us. Well, I don't know how you feel about it, but I just believe that this is the generation that will rise every day, every week, every month, in every trial, in every tribulation, in all temptation, in the midst of a chaotic world. And we will say, I am a winner. And failure for me is not an option. Shake your neighbor and say, neighbor, this is our time. We can't lose. We can't be defeated. We can't turn back. We can't be held back. We can't give up. We can't turn around. God is able. I said God is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we can ask or think according to the power that worketh in us. Y'all excuse me. I gotta go. I said I gotta go. But I appreciate you sitting here while I went through my theses. I appreciate you sitting here while I homiletically and hermeneutically sought to exegete a little bit the text. But right through here, I think it's time for this generation to give God praise. I think it's time for this generation to bless Jesus. I think it's time for this generation to praise a holy God. I think it's time for a limitless huh, generation huh, to praise huh, a limitless God. Huh. Times have changed, huh, but praising God huh, is still the same. Huh. Well, huh, we may be huh, a new generation, huh, but we still believe huh, that when praises go up, blessings huh, come down. Huh. We may be huh, a new generation, huh, with a new mindset, huh? but we still believe huh? that from the rising of the sun huh? to the going down huh? of the same, huh? God is huh? worthy to be praised. Huh? We're pressing forward, huh? but we still believe huh? that we ought to make huh? a joyful noise huh? unto the Lord. Huh? All ye lands huh? serve the Lord with gladness. Huh? Come before his presence. Huh? with singing, huh? know ye that the Lord, huh? he is God, huh? it is he that has made us, huh? and not we ourselves, huh? we are his people, huh? and the sheep of his pasture, huh? come on in, huh? to his gates with thanksgiving, huh? and into
to his courts with praise. Come on in and rejoice in him and bless his name. For the Lord is good. His mercy endureth through all generation. Hit somebody and say, I feel like praising him. I said, hit somebody and say, I feel like praising him. Well, if we're going to break it, if we're going to loose it in here, if we're going to loose it in here, we're going to be that generation. We got to break all limits. We got to break all boundaries. We got to break all restraints. And let's give God a stupid, a crazy, a ridiculous praise. This praise don't need no organ. This praise don't need no drums. This praise don't need no synthesizer. Up above my head, I hear music in the air. There must be a God somewhere. I feel like praising him. Praise God. Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him in a firmament of his power. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him, Joshua, generation. I said praise him, Joshua, generation. Oh, shucks. Let everything that have breath praise God. Shake your neighbor and say, neighbor, I, 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 I feel like giving him glory. I, I, I feel like blessing Jesus. I, I feel like lifting him up. Say yeah. Say yeah. 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 